Okay, how's it going, guys? Just, uh, well, for one thing, I wanted to check out a new mic or test a new microphone that I've got. Um, and uh, maybe you can let me know what you think about the sound quality. Um, as you know, I am in very early days as far as my YouTube uh, is concerned. Um, but yeah, so uh, got this microphone, this clip on microphone, and uh, we'll see how it works. Um, but I thought for the purpose of testing, I would do a quick video on um, the how easy it is to set up a cloud gaming machine. Um, super, super simple, super simple. And uh, if you use the promo code um, that I've got, uh, that I'll put in the description, you'll get $10. Um, which will give you ample um, credit to uh, test it out, have a good play. And uh, again, let me know what you think in the comments. Um, so basically, we're at paperspace.com. Uh, I believe, that, yeah, paperspace.com. Um, I mean, forward slash gaming, because they're now pushing the fact they weren't in the early days. I mean, they were just a cloud, a cloud computing service, but now they're, they're pushing the, the game streaming and the fact that they really do have a superb um, infrastructure to support that. So, uh, and as you can see, um, 60 frames per second cloud gaming, never buy a new desktop again, run any game on your new paper space cloud gaming machine. Um, Top top company as you can see. I mean, they've been featured in uh, in 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 all of the best uh, publications. Uh, stream all the best games. Um, and yeah, simple setup. It is super simple. Um, Partnered with Parsec to deliver the best cloud gaming platform in the world. In, in the world. Um, and you literally can run even the most demanding games. Um, and uh, yeah, from a Raspberry Pi or MacBook Air, um, I'm using it on, I mean, I do most of my daily computing on my um, paper space cloud computer. I've, just got, I've got a Windows computer that I use for my daily computing. It's like 18p an hour. So it's like, it just means that with an older machine that I've got, um, I can... Uh, basically use a very fast and uh, very equipped uh, PC. Um, but as far as pricing, you look at me, they've got the GPU Plus there, 51p an hour. Um, the P5000, which is the one I've got, um, 78p an hour. Um, or you can go super, super um, powerful at the P600. Although, you know, the P5000 does everything. I mean, I've not known it not to, not, not I've, I've, I've not known it to struggle with anything. Not that I really play that many games, but when I have tested it out, um, it's been superb. But they've got this GPU Plus, um, which I've not tested myself, but, you know, it's the entry level, um, but you look, look what you're getting there, you get 8 gig, eight gig, eight gig of memory, um, the cores there, um, it's a superb machine, that's at, like basically 50 cents, roughly an hour, um, and I reckon that's a good value for money. But anyway, just a quick, uh, quick tutorial on how to, uh, Set one up. Um, yeah, so if you go to paperspace.com, um, if you use the um, link in the description, um, it'll also load the promo code for you. So when you've signed in, you've, you've done your sign up, which is super simple, um, you'll have your $10 waiting there for you. Um, but otherwise, if you don't use that link, just put that code in when you set up your machine. And again, it will give you the $10, um, which you'll pay for your 
um, startup fees and uh, a good little bit there to play with as well. So take a breath and create an account you've got with Google or with GitHub um, or you can just put your email address and password in and confirm account. I'm not a robot. Confirm account. Okay, so that's uh, that's really all there is to it. It'll ask you to, um, it will send you an email to confirm your email address and uh, you're in. Um, I've down. I've, I use the um, PaperSpace client, so you can download that onto the Mac or onto your Windows machine. And yeah, it's lightweight, and so it doesn't use much of your machine's resources. And then you're straight into your um, cloud computer. Um, I hope I'm making sense so far. So uh, once you're inside, as you can see, I mean, I've got the daily advanced PC um, and that cost me roughly 18 cents an hour. And I use that on a daily basis um, to do all my work and everything else. Um, and I've got the P5000 Parsec gaming machine there. But once you've signed in, and you've set up your new account, you're basically going to new machine. As far as where you are in the world, you're going to want to select your nearest data center. And they've got West Coast, East Coast, West Coast US, East Coast US, or Europe. Okay. For me, it would be Europe. Um, you then simply scroll down choose what platform um, if you go to public templates you can literally use the Parsec cloud gaming rig and that is completely set up um, and optimized already so it's like out of the box um, ready for cloud gaming um, that's the one I use um, but otherwise you'll just go Windows 10 um you can bring your own license windows 7 windows 7. but for for the sake of the tutorial go okay, windows 10 and we're going to go down to choose machines click it over to monthly uh, well keep it on hourly you click over to monthly you can see these prices can look pretty hefty but i mean that would literally give you almost unlimited usage um, but if we just keep it on hourly, you can see the P5000, 78 cents an hour. Um, or you've got the P4000 at 51 cents an hour. Um, personally, like I say, the P5000 for me um, is perfect. It means, you know, two, three hours of gaming at a time literally cost me under $2. Okay. Um, and you'll see there you've got your monthly storage. So basically what you'll pay monthly is for your storage. And what you're billed for each month is your usage. Okay. So we can see that the P5000, 8 CPU, um, Quadro P5000, um, GPU, 30 gig of RAM um and uh yeah it's a beast and then you come down and choose your storage basically if you like i say for your ten dollars i'd just keep it at 50 gigabytes um because that's going to take five quid straight away out of your ten dollars um you can go 100 gigabytes but you can you can increase you can't decrease but you can always increase so once you've chosen your machine you can increase your storage as you need to. So, you know, you could start off with whatever you wanted to, but if you're trying to keep it within your um, $10 of free credit, just go 50 gigabytes, it's five pounds a month, that's payable in advance, whereas your usage is payable in arrears. 
So you'll build each month for your usage. Um, machine details, you can name your machine there. Um, and we've got uh, just the one machine. Choose network. Um, I mean, these are things that you don't need to worry about. Just leave it on default network. Auto shutdown. I always set my auto shutdown for one hour so that uh, if I do forget about it, it shuts down um, within an hour rather than staying on for a whole day and costing me m more than I want to. So set your shutdown to an hour. That would be my recommendation. Weekly snapshot. So that means if you do happen to do anything that breaks your machine or you, know, you mess it up, You've got a weekly snapshot that means you can roll it back and just reload the snapshot and go back a week where you didn't break the machine, um, which is always handy. I've had to use that on many occasions. Um, so yeah, weekly snapshot. How many of the most recent snapshots do you want to save? Just keep that a one. Um, pop in your payment details. Okay, and here we go. So there's your promo code. So if you were, for example, um, if you hadn't used the link, um, then put your promo code in there. Again, I'll put that on the uh, description. and the promo code there so if you put this promo code in if you hit apply i can't claim it because i've already got an account and i think i claimed one i claimed a referral code when i set up so but basically you'll put that referral code in um and that'll give you ten dollars um so what we're seeing here at the end here okay so you've got your one paper space p5000 machine windows 10 um hourly cost 0.78 okay 78 cents storage cost five pounds a month i've got credit so it would be basically taking the five pounds out of my um credit okay so when you come to set yours up, you'll have total build now. You'll still have naught because you'll have ten pound credit, okay? But it will take five dollars. Uh, sorry, I'm saying pounds. Ten dollar. You'll have ten dollars credit, and it will take five dollars for the storage. And then you just hit create your paper space. Then you've got five dollars, um, which by my calculations. It's, it's the very least it's uh, over five hours of usage on the p5000 machine um and uh you're good to go once you've created your machine you've got core compute machines and you'll find your machine there okay and you just go to your machine it'll load it up and then you're ready to start and that is basically me testing out a my new microphone let me know what you think and b a quick guide on setting up your paper space machine back to console and there we go so you'll have your parsec gaming machine there parsec i might do a video on another occasion about parsec um, and how to use your machine through parsec Otherwise, you'll just be going into your machine, going in and loading it up and having a good old play. And I hope you guys have fun with that because it is super fun. Um, the technology is fun um, and it works really, really, really well. Um, okay.